everyone quick uh, again just a show and tell video I'm showing you my uh, Chris Reeves collection here and it's not big but uh, you know privileged to have what I have uh, these aren't cheap knives as everyone knows you don't need these knives these are luxury goods in any uh, 14 to twenty dollar knife you buy at the local hardware store or online is, is probably going to do a, the task just as well so anyway so this is my uh, regular Sabenza it's the Sabenza 21 regular handles just straight titanium this is the large uh, micarta black handle and this is the small Sabenza this is the Chris Reeves uh, tie lock and this is the Omnum Zen and really if you're just starting out and you're looking at Chris Reeves and you know you're kind of trying to decide which one do you get it's all, all you know it all depends on personal preference but to, to me Chris Reeves is known for the Sabenza so get get the classic one get, get what they're known for right so I'm going to recommend you try to find a black micarta Sabenza. If you can't find that, and I would recommend you can you can try to find one on the secondary market off of forums. That's how I got these two. And they were perfect condition. Highly recommended to do it that way. You'll save a lot of money. But if you need to buy a new one, you know, these are the ones that are you're going to be able to find the fastest. Just the the regular smooth titanium version they're just fine they're just they could be just a hair uh, slippery uh, but it's very nice I've, I've carried uh, all these knives at one point and used them all maybe if there's anyone that I haven't used fully yet it's the TI lock um, okay so go with the Sabenza first if you're into big knives, you know, hunting heavy-duty work knives and don't mind a little bit extra tactical look, <laughs> yeah, you can check out the Omnum Zan. It's, it's definitely a big, bigger knife. Not too far off from the uh, Sabenza, but it has its own unique thing. Pocket carry knives, small Sabenza or the TI lock. Um, you can also look at the uh, Manandi, Man Mandy. I don't know how to say it, but... It's just more of a kind of a gentleman's executive knife. I don't have one of those, but uh, I'm going to recommend uh, going with the small Sabenza over the tie lock, only because the tie lock is expensive and it's just a little finicky. In that, I mean, I think it looks real cool, but it's the lock on it. It's hard to close. I kind of think it's typically, even though you can do it one-handed. It's hard to close one-handed and just the overall dollars for it it's just eh, not quite worth it very nice but not quite worth it I would say uh, go with the uh, small Sabenza I like the blade profile of the tie lock certainly they're on it's pretty awesome so It's uh, basically a medium size between the large and small Sabenza. Okay. That's what they all kind of look like. Let me know if you have any questions.